Well, last weekend, winner, winner, chicken dinner. Today at Warwick Farm, another few winners. Chris, the stable's flying. Yeah, we're having a good run, Rich, but um, a lot of horses and a lot of nice owners supporting, so we're quite lucky. And you, oh, you, you've got to cover the bill. You've got a, a big wage bill, a lot of big earners in your stable. It certainly is. <laughs> they put their hand out too. Now, listen, you've got three runners at, uh, in Sydney on Saturday at Rose Hill. A few interesting ones. I Am Awesome goes around in race four. I know it was coming from the country meetings, but geez, it was terrific run the other day. Yeah, really good run. She had no luck from a gate. She just got caught wide and um, hit the front and, and then just, just uh, wanted to drift out a little bit under pressure. Um, Brenton's rode her before, first go at city level, and she could surprise. They don't run these type of mares races that often, so it's a nice option for her. The one I'm keen to ask you about is uh, in the Kenzo. What a great horse Kenzo was. South Sydney colours. That's right. Race six, Nurse Kitchen. A uh, little bit of an awkward gate too. Yeah, she'll, um, she'll be ridden just back off the speed. Her run first up was very good at Scone. She went to Durban and really struggled around the tight turning track. More suitable here at uh, over the 2,000 metres on a big spacious track and on the she'll race well. They haven't looked after you. I am Orson, 10 of 12. Nurse Kitchen, 10 of 12. Well sprung, 9 of 11. I might have to be an inquiry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, now you sound like, what's that other Richard from Rose Hill? Oh, no. if you missed it on social media, Richard Freeman. Oh, Richie boy, putting on a performance. He kept drawing outside, and while he was sending his last tweet, Barrier 5 comes up on the internet. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> what about Well Sprung? Uh, look, he's probably going better than it looks on paper. Um, may just take this run to really top him off, but he's been working well at home, and I'm expecting improvement on Saturday. The best of your three? I'll say Nurse Kitchen. What's what's a couple of horses in the stable that you're getting ready for the spring? Uh, Miss Fabulous is just back into work. I think she's an exciting two-year-old, rising three-year-old. Um, Lara remains only ever. Oh, a how's Lara remain? He's pulled up really well. I'm really glad that we didn't run in the Stradbroke. It was a testing track. And, Did you think uh, he won the other day? I, I thought he was going to. What really got beat? I thought he was going to win. Impending. The yeah. yeah. But look, he's uh, he's had a couple of weeks off. We'll get him ready for the missile stakes and then possibly the Winks handicap. And or um, well, they're two that. Um, I think he'll race at a good level. The Everest is just 1,200? Well, he was narrowly beaten in the Doom and 10,000 at 1,200. Uh, if it was a wet track, I think someone would be silly not to take him. You, you're training for that? like He's available. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, mate. Newcastle Knights all right? Yeah, they're hanging in there. A little bit stiff on the weekend. It happens all the time, doesn't it? It does. You going to make a comeback? No. Chris Lee's on fire. You. See you. <laughs> you can see him, mate.